Hey guys, welcome back to Mark and Design. Today, let's learn how to simulate a beam on ANSYS. This question is regarding a beam. The beam is 2000 mm long cantilever with a rectangular section of 60 mm and 90 mm. It is also subjected to a load of 4 kN at the right end, that is the free end. It has a Young's modulus of 200 GPA. As shown in the figure, the thickness can be seen as 60 and 90. For that, the solutions are given below. This will be shown in the later section. Let's go to File, Clear and Start New. Do not read file. OK. Yes. Go to preferences, go to uh, structural, okay. Go to preprocessor, element type, add edit delete, add element, go to beam, 2D node 188, okay. Click on close, go to material properties, material modes, structure, linear, elastic, isentropic, it is 200 GPA. That's nothing but 2 into 2e to the power of 5 and this is 0 0.3. Go to section, beam, custom section. Click on square, rectangle. It is 60 mm into 90 mm. So it is 90 and this is 60. Let's go to modeling, create. Key points in active CS 1 0 apply. Second key, uh, key point node will be 2. We be at a distance of 200 mm. So let's put in 200. Okay. Let's go to key points, lines, lines, straight lines. Straight line 1 to 2. Okay. Let's go to meshing, mesh tool. Click on set lines, click on the line, click on OK. The number of divisions would be 50. Click on OK. Mesh again, click on the line, mesh it. OK, done. Close. Now let's go to loads, define loads, apply, structure, displacement, on key points, 1, OK, or DOF, OK. Let's go to force in moment, on key points, last point, okay, it will be in FY direction as shown in the figure or in the numerical, let's go to FY, click on the force, that's minus 4000, 4, okay, now let's go to solution, sol, no, yeah, sol, current LS, okay, Click on close. Go to general pre or post processing. Let's go to element table, define table. Click on add. By sequence number, SMISC3. Apply, okay. Go to by sequence number, 6, okay. By sequence number, 16, okay. By sequence number, 19 okay all done close let's go to plot result contour plot control plot plot control style size and shape click on on okay there we got it the original figure now let's go to nodal solution all dof displacement vector sum okay there we got a displacement vector now let's go to stresses one missile stress, yeah. Okay, that's a one missile stress. So our deformation is 14. Our maximum stress is 98.78 and 778 and this is 98.76. Let's go to line element. Go to the sixth one, SMI six or nine the nineteen. This is how we find it over here. Minus 4000, minus 4000, those are the shear forces.
now let's go to 16 3 and 16 these are our bending moment yeah almost the same there we go thanks guys for watching we'll be back soon